here and welcome to day eight of Vlogtober. And today I am doing a TJ Maxx haul. So I have a few goodies to show you guys. And let me just move that notification out of the way. I wanted to preface this video by saying that I'm going to be boycotting Bath and Body Works for a while. And then also, if you didn't see my last Shrink My Stash video, I did actually get rid of a good number of candles that I've either burnt through or given away to friends. And so I wanted to go buy some new candles because I can only be but so disciplined, you guys, when it comes to candles. But originally, so I saw online, Bath and Body Works candles are for $15.50. And then I heard on a few YouTubers' videos that even though online they were $15.50, in the people's stores they were for $14.50. So I went to my store, but my store, like is going with the same price as the online of $15.50 per a candle on sale. And I just personally think that's ridiculous and I have enough candles for fall, I have enough candles for winter, and if I don't, I can get my candles from elsewhere where the price is a little bit more better. So I decided to go to TJ Maxx, which my TJ Maxx is like two stores away from the Bath and Body Works. I was either gonna go to TJ Maxx or Kohl's, but I was like, well, I'm gonna go to TJ Maxx. I'll probably go get candles from Kohl's another time because I really like the Scentworks candles from there. Anyways, before people click off of this haul, cause I'm just ranting the whole time, I'm gonna go ahead and get into showing you guys what did I get. So the first candle I got is from DW Home and it says, Simply Fall Sweet Apple hand poured and it's in this little gold lettering and the lid is gold with a little apple on it right there so cute and this one is a two wick so I think it will have better luck of pulling out than my one wick um DW home candle that I have it was $7.99 and it smells really really good and I don't know if it says how many ounces it is 15.1 ounces and only $7.99, so what a good deal um, compared to what you can get at Bath & Body Works. The next candle that I got, this is a company that I learned about through TJ Maxx, and I really, really love it. This one is in Autumn Colors, and it has a little, like, knitting. I guess it's, oh, maybe it's scarves, little scarves of different colors on the label. And it says that the keynotes are orange blossom, crisp pear, mint, and sage leaves. And this one smells really, really good, just clean and fresh. And it is 21 point, oh, it is 26 fluid ounces for only $10, so a great deal. And look at this gorgeous purple color wax. I think it looks so stunning. And I have great luck with Village Candles in my house of the two that I've tried. And this is a two wick candle, um, jar candle, which I think the jar candles look super classic and good. And I love the ones that have a throw other than Yankee Candle, which does not have that good of a throw. I also got another village candle, which is more of like a fall and winter. This one is in sugar cookie and the packaging is just these gorgeous little sugar cookies. This one was $10 as well. And the keynotes are creamy vanilla, rich butter and sugar crystals. Mm, and this one smells so good. Literally so good. So the first time I smell these in the store, I'm smelling through a mask. So I feel like I don't get the full effect from it. But this is another 26 ounce um, two wick jar candle. And it was only for $10. So definitely a good steal there. You guys, I'm so excited because I am going to be trying my very first Woodwick candles. I got two. So these were $12.99. They are $17. 0.2 ounces and they have two wood wicks in them. This one is in Snowberry and I think it doesn't have any scent notes but it looks like this just this little one label and the top is so cute it's wood and it's actual like wood and 
This one smells really, really good, like fresh berries. The wax is just this beautiful light green color and it has the two wood wicks in there. And it says, this patented wick design delivers a smooth crackle, fast fragrance, and a better burn. For the best burn results, burn the candle three to four hours per use. Trim the wick to one eighth inches before each use. To trim wick, gently break off burned edges with fingertips and discard, avoid drafts. Yeah, I've never actually trimmed a wood wick candle before, so it's good that they tell you how to. And then the last candle is in Arctic Nights, and it's a Woodwick candle, 17.2 ounces for $12.99, and it has like a dark green colored wax, the two Woodwicks, and this one smells outdoorish, cologne masculine just like really really nice on a fall night i think it's supposed to be for winter because it's arctic nights but like just on a fall night that you want to just have like a cozy masculine outdoorsy scent it would be so amazing <laughs> and then finally i did get um two like food type items so this one is sweetie pie ground coffee in pumpkin pie from Paramount Roasters and it is artificially flavored and this one was five dollars from TJ Maxx. Here's a little something to warm your heart. High quality Arabic beans roasted and ground to perfection by Paramount Coffee in Lansing, Michigan and shared with the one you love. Brewing for every cup combine two tablespoons of ground coffee, six ounces of filtered water, for perfect results, adjust to taste with hot water after brew after brewing. Keep brewed coffee hot and fresh in a carafe. Store coffee in a package or sealed container away from heat and direct sunlight. Always brew with fresh or filtered water. So there is that. And I think it has stuff on this side too. A life without love is like a year without summer is a Swedish proverb, but they crossed out summer and put coffee. That's really, really cute. So there's that. And then another food item that I got is this, and I figured it would be really, really yummy to have on like croissants or biscuits or something like that to celebrate the fall. It is a product of Portugal and it is pumpkin jams with no colorants, no preservatives. And this one was $4. And look at that little, you know, the top is a band, like one of these little stretchy bands, and then paper top. And it just is so nice. Like, I just think it's so classy and nice. And it looks like it's pretty, like, naturally flavored and stuff. It says ingredients is pumpkin, sugar, fruit, pectin, which I don't know what that is, lemon juice, and cinnamon. Store in a cool and dry place. Once open, keep refrigerated and keep and use within 21 days. Um, 25 servings per container, 60 calories, zero fat, zero cholesterol, zero sodiums, 14 total carbs, 12 total sugars, and zero proteins. So, not too shabby. That is the pumpkin jam, so I'm really, really excited to try that. Thank you guys so much for watching. That is the end of my haul. If you have been enjoying Vlogtober and if you enjoyed this video, then please give it a big thumbs up. I will see you guys in my next one, and as always, make sure you stay positive till then. Bye!